Mr. Barking Stork, this is going to be a light bulb moment for you because you're questioning this situation because Wiz is saying it's negative EV. You're the short stack on the bubble up a hyper turbo and you're wondering if you should be shoving. Well, first of all, I always think it's awesome when the number of tips you have matches your cards 38 and 380. That's cool. Um, but more importantly, it's the fact that this is true. Okay, so here's your light bulb moment, my friend. Even if this is negative EV, I don't care because folding is going to be even more negative EV. But what's really important about this situation is this. In this game, you have two opponents. Well, we know since one of you is going to bubble, you're going to have to beat one of these guys. Well, which one do you feel you have a better shot at damaging? The huge guy or the little guy? Well. Duh, common sense says the little guy. So the light bulb moment is attack the little guy. There it is. That's why I would shove here with any two cards because even if this player calls, the reward for beating him gets you closer to cashing than if this player were in the big blind and he was the one who called you. So I love shoving button spots. Like, say, three-handed situations where bubble in the money or whatever. I love shoving button spots when I'm short and the big blind is the short stack. I don't like shoving them when the small blind is the one with 548 and the big blind is the one with 1892. Okay, so there it is. Attack the little guy.